Before making the transeptal portal, a review of the posterior knee anatomy is recommended. This is an example of a flex in the MRI, highlighting the posterior septum directed by the green arrow and its relation to both the popliteal artery denoted as PA on the image and the middle genicular artery pointed out by the red arrow. The middle genicular artery can be seen porphyrating through the posterior capsule along the superior margin of the fat-filled posterior septum space. When compared to an MRI with the knee extended, the flex position creates the greatest distance between the posterior septum and the popliteal and genicular artery. It is important to note that a flex in the MRI is not necessary for preoperative planning, but is used in this report for an anatomical review. Here, we show a pictorial drawing to plan out the creation of the transeptal portal. Once the posterior medial and posterior lateral portals are made, the arthroscope is positioned in the posterior medial portal and advanced laterally to view the posterior septum. Next, a motorized shaver can be placed through the posterior lateral portal to assess the proper trajectory of porphyrating the septum with views from the arthroscope and the posterior medial compartment. In the early studies of the transeptal portal, there was no reported preference for the directionality of creating the portal in terms of lateral to medial or medial to lateral. However, in 2011, Kim et al. demonstrated that the posterior medial compartment is consistently wider than the posterior lateral compartment and suggested that the transeptal portal should be made in the posterior lateral to posterior medial direction. This allows surgeons to have a wider safe zone and thus decreases the chance of neurovascular injury. In this video, we demonstrate the creation of the complete transeptal portal. The arthroscopic shaver is introduced through the posterior lateral portal and placed directly against the septum without penetrating it yet. Next, with direct visualization from the posterior medial portal, the transeptal portal can be perforated. Note that the opening of the shaver is oriented anteriorly in order to avoid pulling on the posterior capsule and risking popliteal artery injury. This arthroscopic picture demonstrates the view from the posterior medial compartment as the motorized shaver is used to increase the size of the transeptal portal. 